from the belief that I have to earn your love. Deliver me, Jesus. I remember the first time that I learned and really understood that God's love is not earned. I was working on getting my certificate in youth ministry, and we were asked to ask God in prayer to answer the question, how do you see me? It was a question that I never really thought to ask before. I was given the image of a flower, a beautiful flower. It was very nice. I thought that was just God's way of telling me that I'm pretty neat, like a flower. But there was so much more to it than that. God, as he often does, answered my question with a question. Why do you love flowers? He asked me. It's true. I do love having fresh flowers in my house. Because they're pretty. They brighten my house. They make it feel more comfortable and homey. I just, I like them. But do they give you any money? He asked me back. No. Do they give you good advice when you need it? No. Do they drive you places when your car breaks down? No. Are they good companions when you're lonely? No. Can they do anything to make you love them more? No. Can they do anything to make you love them less? No. Right. You're always going to love flowers, even though they can't do anything for you. There is nothing that a flower could do to earn or lose your love. I didn't say anything back. You can't earn my love, he said to me. You can't lose my love. My love is given to you freely, completely. I love you simply because I love you. You can never change that. Sometimes I think that some things would be easier if we could earn God's love. It's hard to accept a gift that is so immense, but I'm so grateful. Earning God's love is impossible. We could never achieve it if it wasn't given to us as a gift. He loves you. He will always love you. And nothing that you can do can ever change that. From the belief that I have to earn your love, Deliver me, Jesus.